what's going on guys, I hope you're having a great day, and today I have a follow up to my previous, or one of my previous videos that was a TY and C, text user interface, and now I have fixed some bugs with that that I'm really happy with. So, I think on the original one was, if you were to create an alert box, this header would not show up properly, it would be really bad and ugly. But now I fixed that, and you can see here, it also has support for this little line feature, and that happens, but you know, um, now we can make it actually, you know, work with larger screens if I do this. So you can see it's full happiness if I type in tui.h. Boom, we can see the entire thing here. Um, we have some other features as well, which is uh, I can write to a file, for example, say, just some text. We have some things with multi-line editing now, so I can say, hello, world. That's how I spell world. And the way this is achieved is now in the actual, you know, whatever application you're using it, this includes a header, and you can specify what you want to be the escape character first. So for example, if you're having like a one-line input, maybe you just want to have uh, the intro key be it, but if you have multi-line, maybe you just want it to be tab or something. Or you can uh, hypothetically do like control C or something. Well, not control C, that will be killed the application, but you know, maybe like uh, control F or something, yeah, something like that. Um, it's still a header file, though I do have some things I want to do in the future, such as you know, make it so this isn't like limited to to uh, this isn't limited to only three options, which I know how to do. So I'll probably have to do that at some point. We also do, we also grab the size of the terminal in a much better way now, so that way you know that's how we're able to create this entire thing at the top. Um, so you can hit tab and exit. But yeah, those are the majority of the updates to this. Now I've I'll put a link in the description for the link to GitHub for this, so you can use it if you want. Uh, I'll definitely be adding more features to this in the future, and I'm really excited to see where I can take this and what I can do with this stuff. So, yeah. All right. Anyway, see you.